everyone, this is Logan from Lucky Trader, and I have some exciting news to share. The official unveiling and launch of Lucky Trader Beta at LuckyTrader.com. It's our goal at Lucky Trader to be the premier destination for all tools, content, resources, and analysis as it pertains to NFTs and the NFT ecosystem, and we're confident that we will have those tools available for participants of all skill levels, whether you be brand new to the space, you can see some beginner content here, or if you're an experienced collector and you'd like to dive deeper into NFT collections uh, and the market at large, we'll have some other things to share for you in just one moment. I did want to take these few minutes here just to introduce you to the site and share with you some of the exciting things that you'll have at your disposal starting now with Lucky Trader Beta at LuckyTrader.com. So first and foremost, if you are one of the very beginners in the space, we are going to have plenty of content for you available uh, via the homepage. Page, or if you head to our article section, you'll find even more tutorials uh, to help you stay safe from scams, how to use Lucky Trader effectively, and a beginner's guide to the site similar to this video. Um, beyond that, though, after you've spent some time and you've gotten yourself acclimated with the space, you can start to take advantage of some of our more advanced tools on the site. First and foremost, if you're interested in the market at large taking a look at our nft project rankings page this page is going to give you insight into what's happening in near real time across the nft landscape you can see here this data refreshes every 15 minutes upon loading it's going to start with the uh, collections at the top that have done the most in volume and the most in secondary trading volume over the last 24 hours. But you can simply move those dates around um, to find something uh, of interest to you. You can obviously toggle on the most and the least volume in a particular uh, set of time. You can search for a project if you're interested. Uh, all of this is here accessible uh, very, very quickly at your fingertips. One of the things I do want to point out is one of my favorite parts about this particular page is our is the last column here, the buy now within 10% of the floor. This buy now within 10% of the floor is going to give you a count of how many assets from a particular collection are listed within 10% of this floor price just a few columns over. Although it's not a perfect barometer uh, for potential momentum upwards, if you do happen to find some projects with a very, very um, small count number here in terms of their overall collection, um, this is potentially an indicator of uh, a thin floor or, or something where the price could move upwards quickly um, should people uh, you know, take these from the bottom of the collection. So, so something that's a little unique to this page and one of my favorite parts about it, just something to keep an eye on. Of course, not investment advice, uh, but something that you can use to help build your NFT collection. If building that collection uh, and you have a core focus on one particular set of NFTs or a collection of NFTs, you can use our NFT drop down at the top to find our NFT asset explorer. So you saw after clicking into Cool Cats here, I'm now brought into the NFT asset explorer where I can explore all of the assets within the Cool Cat collection. You'll notice that this gets automatically populated based on our proprietary rarity rankings at luckytrader.com. Uh, so you can sort through these though, uh, add in attributes if you wanted to focus on those Cool Cats with afros. You can add in attributes to, to sort through and find things that that are uh, of most notable to you or most interesting to you. You can also use our dynamic ranges if you wish to filter on the, you know, the top 1,000 in terms of rarities, and we can turn off the attributes here. Um, whoops, we can focus on that and then see your top 1,000 rarities, right? Um, add in a buy now filter to be able to see, you know, of these top 1,000 what's available for purchase. You'll also see, you, know, you can immediately access these via OpenSea and make a purchase should they be the ones that you are so inclined to buy. Beyond this, we also can dig in deeper to a collection using the traits page. The traits page is going to give you all of the traits that are accessible in the metadata from a particular collection. And it's going to tell you individual statistics for those particular traits. You'll see that TV face Bob Ross has a floor price of 79 Ethereum, uh, a rarity score. This is our individual rarity score for that trait. It's going to tell you how many 
traits uh, or assets with this trait exist and then how many of those assets with this trait so how many tv bob rosses uh, are for sale 10 of the 21 are listed for sale last but not least you can also dive into the transaction page for a particular collection uh, from the transaction page you're going to get access to all of the secondary sales from this particular collection. You can look at it over the last month, over the last week, day, or all time. Again, this is one of my favorite parts about the individual asset uh, pages. Uh, from here, we can start to layer in. If you are looking for a particular asset, let's say you're looking to add a beanie, um, a beanie black cat, you can go to all time sales of beanie black uh, cool cats and you can see you know where have the bulk of sales been over the course of the last week or the last month or all time and from there gauge or create sort of evaluation in your mind at what might a fair price be if you're looking to buy a particular asset again you can use the dynamic ranges up here as well to filter in different rarities and beyond so that's kind of staying up to date on historical or existing collections. What if you want to stay up to date on what's coming? Well, of course, you can use our schedule page, uh, luckytrader.com, to, to start to prepare not only your wallet, but also your calendars appropriately for upcoming notable collections in the NFT space. You could scroll through here, gain access to the Twitters and the, the Discord communities for these individual um, collections and projects that will be upcoming. See a small description of them and do a little bit of your own research. Of course, always do your own research before investing, but we've curated this a little bit for you to get started so that you don't have to search all over the web uh, when trying to prepare to buy more NFTs. And last but not least, of course, if you are into Zedrun specifically, and you are learning a little bit more about the tournaments and you want to know more about stables and horses available on the market, please do use knowyourhorses.com, the Lucky Trader product. You can access that via the tab right there. Head over to Lucky, or sorry, to Know Your Horses and start uh, plugging away at the data and analysis uh, for Know Your Horses and Zed Run, the premier destination for Zed Run data and analysis. But please, all things else, uh, head over to luckytrader.com. Take advantage of all of the tools and resources that we have available for you. Uh, we hope to hear great things from you. I can't wait to hear your feedback, get your feedback, and keep adding and uh, working together to build successful collections in NFTs.